Well, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. We are out here on this beautiful afternoon. We're gonna check some apartment dumpsters and see what we can find. Oh, man. Oh, gross. I hate when there's just piles. Yeah, me too. That's nasty. You're a very dirty shower caddy type thing. Oh, that is filthy, isn't it? Yeah, this one's a whole lot of trash. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Alrighty. Nothing at the very first spot of the day, but we're gonna be moving on and see if we can find anything. All right, next spot. Let's see. Ooh. Okay. Um. This one like has one ginormous pad oh. padding thing. I don't know what that is exactly, but it's like I don't know if that little caddy might be okay. It'll use the claw to get that out. <laughs> I think it'll come out now. Nice. nice. Yeah, that's all right. A little dirty on the inside. Yeah, probably. It's like we always find stuff and kind of need to just be able to like put a tarp over it in the front. Yeah, that one's not a bad one. It's kind of thin, but... That one has holes. Yeah, it's great. It's going up right there. So. Probably stay down in the sun too long. But that one looks okay. Yeah, not bad. Dog yeah. Is that what that is? Yeah. It's... Wow, it's so big. It smells um, like... Oh, it smells urine. really bad, actually. It, does, uh, yes, it smells pretty bad. Okay, <laughs> too big to wash. <laughs> Is there anything in this one? I'm gonna get the moving thing. It was nothing obvious. So. No, there wasn't anything nice in there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as you stab it, uh, this one's back enough in here. Uh, let's go there. All right, let's roll. All right, there we go. We got a caddy and a tarp. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, we're moving on here. <laughs> Take that. Okay, we're at another dumpster here, and ooh, it's wobbly. Yeah, it looks like something that somebody definitely could refurbish. Yeah, this leg's kind of coming off right there. All right, one little low table. We're not gonna take it. Several slices of pizza. We're not gonna take them. <laughs> And in here... Just a portion of a ceiling fan. Yep, just a portion of a ceiling fan. Not the good portion. <laughs> the bad portion of a ceiling fan. <laughs> okay. Nothing there. <laughs> We're moving on. Right. What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, a bunch of leaves. <laughs> Scrounge around here. Oh, yeah. Thing. Mostly sticks. <laughs> we do have back here what I would call maybe the world's oldest rocking oh, chair. Wow! It has literal springs. Oh this man, is... if that rocking chair could talk, <laughs> the stories it would tell. Wow! Go the ghosts of just generations are haunting this thing. Seriously, oh, it's like burlap over the wire springs. Oh, it's dusty. Ooh, if that dust could talk. <laughs> this rocking chair needs a tetanus shot for sure. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Don't get stuck in it. it okay. Like a saw trap. I know, it's kind of scary. Don't sit on it. <laughs> no worries there. Well, we'll definitely be leaving that. And we will be moving on. Oh, you found your water bottle in the back. Great. <laughs> Featuring the water bottle. The water bottle. <laughs> okay, that was the world's oldest rocking chair, and this is the world's largest tambourine. Oh, it's a tabletop. <laughs> These little diamond studs so make it look like a big old you tambourine. You could make it a giant tambourine, which would be a cool project. We'll let someone else, anyone from the channel that wants to do that, it's right here for you. Rubbage. Anything in that uh, 
longer to take you. Yeah, it's getting a tiny amount of gold. Alright, well, there we go. Off to a great start of items that we will not be taking. <laughs> Moving on. New dumpster. Ooh, dumpsters. Let's see. Okay, someone solicited and they threw away all their little pamphlets. Um, oh, this bag is very heavy. It's, um, what is it? Oh, it's stinky. Oh, it's, um, installation. Okay, that's construction. Oof! Oof! Don't breathe that in. It's like ceiling tiles. Let's see about it over here. Oh, this one's a little bit empty. One pretty dank pillow at the very bottom. One little ephemera? I can't get it. <laughs> he gives up instantly. Oh, you got it! Oh. She's so away too soon. Yeah. He's half-heartedly half giving it his all. This is riveting footage. <laughs> okay, get it by that little thing. There you go. It's now the, flip it. It's the slot for the moving keys. Thank you. Oh, moving keys. I love that. That'll get scanned for sure. He's whacking at it. What's your problem, Dad? <laughs> I see that it's trash. <laughs> yeah, me too. Okay. <laughs> All right, there we go. <laughs> so scary. We got our little paper, which I will be keeping in my pocket here, um, in order to scan because that's the kind of stuff that we like to take when we're dumpster diving. <laughs> Okay, but for real though, we do like taking that ephemera stuff, little pieces of paper like that, whether it's like modern or we find a lot of vintage stuff like that. And we do think it's really cool to see. Um, Alex got a giant poster, but we're, we're taking that for sure. <laughs> it's a giant uh, Dr. Pepper poster. Is it really? Yeah. Two for two Dr. Pepper. Wow. Oh, that one's a Dude, this Look at that! Right <laughs> well, that one we will not take. It's too big for our scanner. It's too big. We did buy, um, it got here yesterday, a scanner so that we can actually start scanning a lot of the ephemera that we've found right now. We've just been collecting it. Um, so we have a whole bunch of it that we're going to be able to start scanning and in that way we can share it with y'all uh, in a better way than just how we kind of hold it up to the camera to show y'all. So we're pretty excited about that. Uh, so that's why I wanted to take that little move-in uh, envelope. Ooh, this is a lot of trash. Okay. Grab it and I'll try to get it. Ooh, I feel the trash. <laughs> oh, it's open and it's dumping out trash. Yeah, let me put it back on top so that it doesn't blow away in the wind. Mm. Ooh, it smells like pickles. <laughs> he needs to find the pickles. All these bags are open. You smell them now? Yeah. They're coming from somewhere. <laughs> I doubt that it's like us. <laughs> Great haul worth of pickle I don't think so. Okay. Just food trash is all yeah, I'm man. unfortunately getting to today. A whole lot of food trash. Well, all right, there we go. Nothing at that one. So we're moving on. The broken glass. Okay. Oh, broken glass. Oh, look at this. This is a whole bed. A whole last bed frame. It is a whole bed frame. That'd be nice if I was in there. A treadmill playlist for walking and running needs to have a steady beat, at oh. least 20 songs. Ooh, like a G6. Tia Tamara. Oh my god, they play all these at kickboxing. Let me take that so I can use their playlist. Duluth. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> it's got like all this rice on the back of it. <laughs> That's the. Uh... 
their carbo loading for their treadmill run. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Kind of hard with that big thing on top, I guess, to see if there's even anything. <laughs> What's old this? Box. Uh, old box, some different bottles. Yeah, all kinds of cool items. <laughs> <laughs> this is a trashy day. Uh, Sheba. Sheba. Cuts and gravy. Bones could never. Nice. He's a new little man. <laughs> <laughs> all right, folks. All right, let's Moving on, team. Hello. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. This is like pretty broken, but I've been wanting a basketball net. Look at your friend. It's like a, it's kind of, it's pretty broken, obviously. It's like the full thing, but I've been wanting a little rim. I know. And so I could just take the rim off and make it work. It doesn't work anymore. So. I'll get that knife out of the car. Yeah, that's like pretty much what you've been wanting. I can take these off and just That's make cool. a new one. And it's like a good size. This has like, is this what was attached that That's you just like cut the, off? Yeah, it's normally kind of the return thing. There's something heavy in it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look Yikes. at that though. Nice. Some yeah, I mean, there's some so serendipity sewing workshop tips, tricks, projects for those who love sewing. <laughs> That's you! <laughs> Gotta take this as well. Yeah. yeah there might be more stuff in here. Oh, I should have put my gloves on. That's a whole future. Oh, it's that box right there. This has got, we don't need to take these for the six. If those were in a box still, that probably would have been good. There's some little colorful glue sticks. Okay, so those came out of that box. I guess I'll use this box then. Look, here's some colorful blue sticks. <laughs> um, it was from right here in the center, so... Yeah, I know. This is like... This might be our one-hit wonder of the day. Is that clothing? <laughs> That's true. Oh yeah, look at that! That's clothes. Is this box full of stuff? Look, it says art supplies on it. And it's really heavy. But I don't want to tip it over. That bag I just moved might be closed too. Oh, that is closed. All right, I'll be back. I'm putting my gloves on. Yeah. Oh, look. What's in there? I don't know. Stuff. Okay, let me take it. <laughs> Ooh, it's wet on the bottom. Yeah. Oh, why don't I have gloves? I thought you went to pictures. Oh, no, I got this instead. Let's see. Look, folks. Let's see. Um, these are not art supplies. Oh, <laughs> really? Not Darn any art convinced. supplies I've ever seen. This is garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look at that. It's a bunch of kids' clothes. Yeah. And a big gallon of milk. I saw that. I need a box. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if all of these would be 
salvageable. That's great. Some of them are over there, kind of uh, piled in different bags of poop. Oh. But the okay. other ones over here. These kids play the They look like they just washed them and tossed them. <laughs> Classic, you Classic know? Wash and toss. I don't really know if I'm gonna dig the ones. Out of the poop? poop yeah, I wouldn't. That's not even kid poop, it's dog poop. So, uh, what do you think about this? I don't think it's cold. cold. You don't feel like that's cold? Let me touch it. Oh yeah, that's actually pretty cold. I'm gonna take it, it expired yesterday. Okay, great, let's tell her they tossed it, I guess. There we go. Some kind of interesting knife sheath with all these tassels. This is kind of an interesting bag. It's like, I'm not sure what they had going on with that, but all those little charms could be used yeah, to, in like a, a jewelry. Cool blade. Yeah. There's an air tag. They wanted to see where their trash went. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not in there. In our house. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, there's stuff in here for sure. Here's just a little case. Oh, there's a... Alright, that's a little organizer. Here, let me hand this stuff to you to be quick. Some kind of pumpkin. Something. Like kind of Ooh, it. we got the sticker set with this band. GOT7 seven. 16. P oh, yeah. This is a word, isn't it? I'm gonna guess there's seven members. I'm gonna there. guess there's seven boys. <laughs> Alright, let me take out some of these papers. Oh, another one. Very cool. This whole uh, bag might be. Somewhat worth taking. Maybe not. Oh, see, like, there's little stuff. Like, there's a gibbets. Wop. <laughs> oh, there's a nice family photo or something. That's cool. Oh. I almost just do want to take this because of all of the small pieces at the bottom. There's a penny. Let me just take out the obvious trash and I'm gonna take this bag to go through at home. Oh yeah, see like look, there's a like I bet a bunch more of those fell out on the bottom. Not bad. I don't want their mail. <laughs> Not really into people's mail. They're Kroger cards. Here they're fly swatters. <laughs> These are super interesting, like, they're on this royal Kodak paper and laminated. Yeah, they're cool. It's like Vietnam. Ooh, look at this. These glasses are broken, but how cool is that, <laughs> like, piece of it? That is cool. Oh, oh, look, is that a thumb? Yeah. Not bad. It's cracked, we but we got one. Okay, I'll take this bag. Yeah. Nice. And then all these kids' clothes. That's really great. Wash them up. Get them donated. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. That's really cool about your hoops. I know. I've been wanting hoops. I know. That's a great project. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Moving on. Alright, let's peek at this and see what we got. Ooh, that's kind of what I thought. I thought it might be a... Yeah, that's food trash. Okay, we got some piles here. Different furniture pieces. That's not terrible. Some of maybe would want to get that. Just a little, uh... I don't know, it's like a half futon that you could just lounge on. But okay, nothing at that one. We're kind of over here uh, in a different part of town, more uh, closer to the universities now. So different area. We're gonna keep going and see what else we find.
We stopped for some iced teas and we are at a new dumpster. Oh, he's looking disappointed. Hmm. Yeah, pretty much. I see why. Pretty much it's a yeah. swing and a miss. Yep. All right, well, there we go. Getting back in the car. Getting barked at by a dog. <laughs> We're moving on. Ready? Yep. Let's do this. Oh, there's a car. Let's do this. <laughs> okay. New complex. Okay, we got some type of um, heating element. Uh, one big pan lid. Possibly some articles of clothing on this side. Oh, there's another piece of clothing, this potentially. Side. Maybe move that bag off the top of it and see if it's... Oh. <laughs> that was a heavy one. Alright, that could be... That could be some clothing. Let me get a grabber, too. <laughs> okay, nice. I'm over here now. <laughs> okay, she's moving around. She's over here on the power. Yep. Oh, she's also my grabber. Okay. okay, these are some ladies' clothes. Oop, nice uh -huh. shirt. B, the change. Little bumblebee. Oh, darn, that was it for the clothes. <laughs> Looks like a lot more, but all right. Ooh, cans. All right, not bad though. Okay. A lot of trash. All right, let's keep it moving, moving y'all. <laughs> no time to waste. No time. All right, put them with our other clothes. We didn't really even look in these. This actually might be a big comforter. Now that I see it, it kind of looks like it's all one pattern. Oh yeah, I wanted to see what it is. It's a big comforter. We've been taking lots of blankets as it's been cold to this thrift store that benefits the women's shelter. First, they take anything to the women's shelter or like the homes and the apartments that they've set people up in. So they take stuff there first and whatever they don't need for those, they put in the thrift store to sell. So we like donating to that one, so that's been great. And uh, all right, good stuff, we're moving on. This is the tiniest little bit of snow and ice that we have left from our Texas cold front. And let's see what this dumpster offers. Clothes. Clothes maybe of some kind, or is that just... Uh-oh, big box. Ooh! Ah! A few clothes. A few clothings. One uh, kids, two ladies. Oh, look. Even more. That's something. Oh, a corset. Is that what that's called? I feel like that didn't sound right when I said it. Oh, a shoe? Single shoe. Oh, I didn't know this <laughs> okay. Oh, there's a type of clothing or a bag? A bag? Uh, that's one up. Big torn. <laughs> big, big torn. Alright. A little bit of clothing with a lot of trash. Little trash. <laughs> smells goofy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, what's that kind of box in there? Uh, probably a shield or something disgusting. It's pretty bagged up. It looks like from this side, it looks like it says Keurig. Is it a brand new? Okay. I feel like someone put something in my <laughs> <laughs> It's probably kitty litter. Most of the time, if it's heavy, it's kitty litter. <laughs> oh, 
choosing Keurig. I'm just so open to the All right, big reveal. Chances of it actually being a Keurig. <laughs> it's pretty remote. Oh my goodness. It's a Keurig. It's a Keurig. Okay, let's take a picture of that. Interesting. What a twist. That's it, for sure. Nice. Very... I wonder why they like tried to hide it from us. <laughs> they did try to hide it from us. Maybe it got recalled or something? Maybe, but it was never taken out of the box. That's weird. Is it silver on the box? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks just like that, doesn't it? It's anywhere. <laughs> That's not true. That can't be true. Huh? That's a funny one. That's kind of cool. Wow. I guess maybe let's keep digging around in here. Yeah, I mean. Yeah, that was interesting, wasn't it? We do find K cups kind of often. We haven't in a while, I guess, but sometimes we do. So if we wanted to even keep that for ourselves, we could. Pretty cool. Ooh, that's trash. Okay, I'm saying don't hide out there. Yeah, let's <laughs> Yeah, okay. We got the Keurig. <laughs> He's got to poke it all, and that's what a good dumpster driver does. So there we go, y'all. That's going to be our last stop of the day. Brand new, in the box. I stabbed it several times. You did stab it. Thankfully, it hopefully didn't break. No, it certainly didn't. Yeah. That's so, it's so interesting being in an apartment complex. Yeah. Being kind of open but taped back. We'll have to, we'll have to see, but it does pretty much seem like it's a brand new Keurig in there. My only thought maybe is that they bought a replacement. And sometimes we do see people put like the old one back in the box, but that's like in the original like interior oh, packaging. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it didn't really look repacked. Yeah. We can open it up when we get home and yeah, awesome. Brew up a quick cup. <laughs> yeah, we'll brew up some cups for us when we get home. Bones is playing in the sink. <laughs> okay, we're back home. Um, I just want to see if this Keurig works. So let's get out of the box and see. It is weird to me that it's like brand new. That was taped to it. Just this little message. I do feel like Keurigs are pretty wasteful as far as like all the plastic cups, so we've never wanted to get one. Um, but it's more wasteful if they just go straight to the landfill, and we find them a lot, the little K cups. And so, oh, this has been used. Okay, I can see right away that it's been used. So, I think the theory might be right that they they replaced their old one, maybe? The cord is still wrapped up like that. And the only reason I say it's been used is because there's like a little bit of um, something right there, residue-ish. And on the top here, this kind of looks like it might have a crack on it. It just doesn't look like how it would come if it was brand new. I guess I don't even have a way to test this, do I? If I don't have K-cups. Do I just plug it in? All right, plug it in. Does it have a light anywhere? It's like you can tell I've never had a Keurig. Guns, what do you think? How do I do it? Oh, there we go, there's a power button. Nothing lights up. There's a button on top that looks like a play button. I think it's broken. I think that this is an elaborate way to throw away their old Keurig. Ouch! <laughs> because wouldn't you think there would be a light when you push it? Or a sound? Or possibly if you pushed the play button, it would do something? Okay, 
Well, Bon's decided to go ahead and get in that box like a good kitty. So there's Bones in the box. Here's our bananas hung up in this basket that we found recently. They're looking great. It holds them well. <laughs> and I guess that's, um, that's, that's it. I don't think that this Keurig machine works. I do think that it was kind of a odd way to throw away their old one, but I'm gonna bet that they just really liked this one. So they got an immediate or exact replacement for it. And they did go ahead and box it up and throw it away. Uh, in the original box with the original packaging. So a little bit disappointing. I was kind of excited to have a Keurig, um, but that's okay. This is what we've been using for our coffee. Nice old fashioned instant coffee. <laughs> and I actually am really enjoying the simplicity of it. So that's how we're gonna continue drinking coffee for now. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Are you just biting it? Is that a bright light on you? Enjoy. <laughs> okay, so there we go, y'all. I'm gonna go back outside. I'll show you um, like a glance of the truck bed again, just so that y'all can see, but I'm really exhausted and I'm not gonna do a final haul reveal. Um, this is a kind of crazy bag, isn't it? I didn't even look in here. What is this stuff? This looks like party, party favors. Pigs in a blanket, those are adorable. Little memos. This is just like one small bag that you could put something small in. One small gift box. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Is that a glue stick? No, that's a lip balm. Okay, this is an interesting bag. Doesn't this kind of look like party favors? Another lip balm. Um, I don't love reaching in here without my gloves. It's kind of, kind of gross. There's a chocolate mix for cocoa. Another cocoa mix. This kind of looks like a diver. There's some gum. They had one piece, they didn't like it. <laughs> Ooh, this? Ooh, those are so good. I love these chocolates. So this is a very miscellaneous bag. To me, it looks like um, a party. Maybe some leftover party favors, party supplies. Uh, we got some miscellaneous stuff in here. We have those cool uh, family photos as well as like the phone. It's broken. It's cracked on there, but people like to buy those um, anyways. And we have these types of family photos, which we are going to scan. Like I mentioned, the scanner. We're going to start doing some stuff like that because we're really interested in that. I love um, seeing the like memorabilia stuff that people throw away. And so we do want to start like kind of incorporating that more. And that way we can show you guys because a lot of times when we find um, what kind of seems like somebody's whole life that was thrown away, it is hard to show it uh, in a video. And we've found some really cool stuff. Like we found um, like a flat Stanley that is like signed by George Bush. And it has like this paper with it that's written from George Bush that says like it's to the school and it says like take him on all your adventures and stuff and then there's even a photo of George Bush holding the actual flat Stanley that we found and all of this was together in a manila envelope and it's stuff like that that I just think is fascinating I think that it's not only super interesting but also interesting that somebody would throw it away and so we want to be able to start showing you guys that more and just scanning it in order to digitize it to to really document it for us because that's the kind of stuff that we're super into with dumpster diving not only finding you know great hauls or big retail hauls of the cards or Halloween costumes or things that stores throw away but also things like that that are just very personal um, and like intimate into people's lives I'm just fascinated by it and so we do want to start digitizing that stuff that we've found maybe we'll do a newsletter um, where we can maybe do like once a month and show you guys stuff like that um, um, or maybe we could do like a cool blog or put that on a website or something of just more stuff like that because that is what we're interested in um, as far as like things that we find in the trash. That's one of the coolest things that like I love to find is vintage ephemera like that. The other thing that we want to start um, more documenting is the stuff like this basketball goal. 
that Alex is gonna um, take this part off right there just with whatever tool you need uh, for that and then we showed you guys how we found that projector so he's gonna project onto new um, wood and make a new backboard where he'll project a design and then be able to like jigsaw cut it out and put this back on a new backboard that is a design that he's done so it's those kind of like art projects, creative projects that we really want to start more documenting and showing you guys some of that stuff. Um, so that'll be in the future, but be on the lookout for it if you're interested in that because we're kind of interested in pursuing more things like that that we are just passionate about and we love sharing with you guys our dumpster dives and maybe we'll be able to share with you guys like what we end up doing with our dumpster finds. So there we go. Other than that in the truck bed, we got some great clothes. That's bedding right there. This has clothing in it. Oh my god, and what is that? What is that? Oh, I don't want to touch. What is it? Oh. Okay. It's... I think it might be a cat toy, actually. Oh my gosh. I think it's a cat toy. What's that thing on the end? <laughs> what is this? Okay, so I don't know what this is. I don't think I looked in this bag. Um, it is a lot of clothes in there, but that thing is weird. Maybe it's a tail. Maybe it is a tail, actually, and you're supposed to hook your belt through it. I think that's what it is. And then it hangs down as a tail. Okay, so, you know we find the craziest things in the dumpster, but there we go. It was a great haul today. We had a lot of fun, and it's been super cold here, like in the single digits here. Um, and this is the first day that it's back up in the 50s. So it's beautiful weather. I think we're getting another cold front here, though, um, coming in tomorrow, but we're gonna just try to dive as much as we can so thank you guys so much for watching this video we loved bringing y'all along and we will see y'all very soon have a great week and happy diving bye